This is our video number six on uh, project costing in Intel ERP9. And uh, in this video, we are discussing about the purchases. In our last video, which is related with the quotation, which is video number five, we sent a quotation to our customer. And let's assume it that quotation is approved by our customer. So if you want to check that quotation, we need to go in the display. And here we have this day book. And in Daybook, this is our quotation voucher. Enter. So this is the quotation which we send uh, to our customer. And let's assume it that this quotation is approved uh, by the customer. So now in the next step, what you need to do, we need to make some purchases for the construction of uh, for the building for our customer Al Musalla company to buy. So uh, before starting the process. The purchase process the first step we need to check that either the purchase order feature that is activated in your company or no so here the purchase order is activated but if you want to check that uh, if you want to know that how to activate the purchase order feature in Dell ERP 9 we need to click on this feature and that is inventory features so in the inventory features we need to activate this order processing enable purchase order processing and for the sale order processing we need to make these two options yes by default these two options are no so we need to make these two options yes if you want to use the purchase order or the sale order or the quotation feature in Dell ERP 9 so once we activated this feature this order watcher will come here so we need to create we need to issue a purchase order the LPO to our supplier so we need to go in the order voucher in the order voucher we have this purchases the short key is alt f4 we need to select the party account so let's suppose it that we are buying it from uh, sigma builders llc enter and that is a supplier information you can mention the terms and condition enter and that is our let's assume it the order number is 55 enter we are doing the purchases so select the purchase account so we are issuing right now the purchase order so what are the items we are going to buy so we have bricks enter and uh, that is enter location we are getting this uh, uh, the bricks in the Dubai warehouse enter the quantity is 10,000 and uh, the rate is in the sales we gave this 20 so here we have let's assume it is 16 enter next we have sand by warehouse quantity is 20 thousand thirty then we have cement bags by warehouse and that is four hundred and the rate is hundred dirham and then we have paint by warehouse Dubai warehouse is our location. 1000, the rate is 65. Then we have pipes. Pipes are 5000. Location is Dubai warehouse. And that is 25 dirham. Then we have steel rods. Location is Dubai warehouse. Quantity is 2000. The rate is 30. Then we have Teflon tapes. Location is the buy warehouse. And 500 is the quantity, and 10 is the price. Enter. Enter, and we need to apply that is with the VAT. And the 40,750 is the VAT. Enter, enter, and this is how 
purchase order issued to Sigma builders as enter and uh, you can save it and if you want to check that item wise text analysis so we have this option that alt a or you can click this text analysis click on detail if you want to see item wise uh, the fat amount that on the purchase of breaks the total amount and uh, the total amount is 160,000 and the 5% is 8,000 so you are paying fat 8,000 on the breaks similarly we have these teflon tapes that is total 5,000 5% so we are paying 2,250 uh, there are fat on this teflon tapes so that is our text analysis uh, which is alt a is a short key or you can click this text analysis to split the line item to show individual item wise that amount the taxable amount so we need to save this purchase order enter enter and save it so this is how we create a purchase order in tele rp9 and if you want to check the reports that how many purchase order we have uh, we issue in this month or day or this week so for that you need to go in the display enter in display we have inventory books which is i enter and there we have this purchase order books enter so in month of january we have only one purchase order so if we press enter it will drill, drill down the report so that is the date on which we created this issue this purchase order uh, to the party to the supplier which is sigma builder llc the voucher type is purchase order the voucher number is one which is system generated and this is our order reference number our purchase order uh, our purchase order number which is 55 and that is the total amount of purchases 855,750 you can click on this option to if you want to see this in detail so the purchases is this much the VAT is this much so this is how we are creating a purchase order in Delhi ERP9.